So when we last left our heroes, we had just gone to Venderbrugen. Yeah, we just turned in another color, the and the the Aposion, Aposion <laughs> chess piece. And now we are so close to being able to buy our next ship that I think we're just going to sell the rest of our blue Centilac. Yeah, I think so. And then buy that ship, start scoping out the prices of deck guns, and then we had that kind of talked about it in between videos. We're just the next ship we're going to buy won't have a forward slot, so the me the Memento Mori will be basically irrelevant to us. Yeah, we can uh, take it over to the Fathom King turn it in instead of our cool engine. Yeah, because, well, yeah, we'd rather have an engine to drive around with. Than yeah. a, you can't, I mean, f using firing a cannon to move, I mean, it works, but it's expensive. And it takes a long time. Yeah. And we're in... Uh, there, we know that there's another engine up in Frostfound somewhere. I've never been inside Frostfound. I hear it's real dangerous, and I don't know how close we are to being able to complete that. Yeah. So what we're going to do, just get the new ship, hopefully be able to buy a, re a pretty good uh, rear gun. Yep. And maybe upgrade our deck gun, because that is also still weak. Yeah, possibly. And uh, it's been serving us okay, but mostly because in the Death Spiral, none of the pirates can hit us. Yeah. But there are bigger things than pirates out there. Yeah, which I hope to fire out of my rear while I run from them like crazy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so uh, to the shipyard. Or to no, the alarming scholar. Nothing to hide. Nothing to hide. Collect messages. Blind bruiser. Oh, of course you do. Go ahead. Okay. Agree. We're going to need some money after we drop all this money. Yeah, he... Uh, cons heart. Yep. Okay, so, so alarming scholar. Yep. Uh, getting rid of these Cintelex. Yes. 800. Yes. And then blue Cintelex. I hope... I hope we don't need one of these for something. Uh... There's other places we can get them, sure. And... That's all of them, I think. Okay, now let's go to the shipyard. Okay. Let's we look. only have... Remember, we only have actually 8,000. Because that... Uh, the um, the blind bruiser gave us 1,000. Oh, yeah. And what we're going to trade in for two as well. Yes. So... We're looking at the Caligo class merchant cruiser. Yes, uh, three hundred hull, crazy hull capacity, much heavier. I think we might travel quite a bit slower. Yeah, there's a chance. Quarters thirty, well, a lot we, more dudes. Yeah, it's harder to hide in such a big ship, but it's m more hearty. Yeah. Okay. All right. Last uh, chance. Yeah, let's do this. Trade. Boink. Name your new ship. Um. Hmm. This was such a hang-up last time. Uh, yeah, I honestly, I didn't even think about this. I didn't even think about the names that we had thought of last time. Uh, well, we could give it a quick name based on what it does. The, uh, hmm. Hmm. We could name it in, uh, in memory of our, uh, Nacreous friend. Ooh, yeah. We could just call it the Outcast. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. And I'd, I'd say let's put the in there. Yeah, the... Oops. Ah, okay. I was fooled. I thought I outcast. All right, there we go. In thank you, sir. In memorandum, memoriam. <laughs> um, okay, so go to the uh, shops. Okay, we need to buy a rear gun. Yes, iron and misery, maybe. No, no. Caminus yard. Okay, these guys are caminus, depending. Yeah. So these guys, the caminus yards, have the more expensive guns. Let's see. This is a forward deck forward. Uh, they don't have any Engine rear guns. Aft. Here we go. Oh, it's oh, they're for fifteen hundred. Uh, it's actually oh, stagger amount eight seconds. Jesus. Twenty eight hull damage. Twenty eight life, life damage. damage. Those are pretty good. Yeah, pretty expensive, but crew damage plus two one. Speak not of it. Okay, let's uh, let's look at the other guys. Okay, what do these guys got? That's an aft weapon. The discouragement. Twenty four. Twenty four. Actually, pretty close to the same. The other one was 28, 28. Yeah. But it's still a stagger amount, 8 seconds, the same, warm-up time. And it's, it's uh, much half less. the cost or less. What's the uh, Scorpion? Let's see. Where's... Oh, yeah, up here. Uh, 22, 22, stagger oh, amount, 6. I was just wondering. Warm-up time, 6. It didn't have a picture. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, here's my idea. Let's mm -hmm. see. We can spare 2,000. Yeah, we could probably upgrade both our guns. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, for 2,000? Just one of them. So we still want to be able to buy food and supplies and stuff. Well, what I was going to say is we could get the... Look at the uh, the 1,500 one. Uh, the denation. The denunciation, I think it is. I don't know. So 28, 28. 
Warm up time six, stagger eight. Okay, so go back to the other one. That one is uh, the it's bottom. That one is oh, twenty four twenty four. Warm up six. This one is slightly less yeah. than the other one, but it's vastly cheaper. Right. I'd say we buy this one. Okay. And then we also upgrade our deck weapon. Oh, okay, I'll do that. So buy. And then what what deck uh, weapon do we have? Okay, let's install that real fast. Aft. Okay, we've we've got the denunciation. Yeah. Yeah, fifteen fifteen. Yeah, we definitely need to replace that thing. Yeah. So let's go back to the shops. So we got fifteen hundred to spend on this thing. Check out the deck weapons. I would say Okay, the Hell Thrasher. Fifteen hundred exactly, eighteen eighteen. Eighteen eighteen. I don't know. That's actually 18. not that not no. that big of an upgrade. No, it isn't. Aft. Hold on. Naval surplus. Forward, forward, deck. That's the one 15, we have. 15. Oh, it's surprisingly good. Yeah. So do you want to go from 15 to 18? What's the majesty? Uh, forward weapon. Ah. Sting, forward, forward, deck. 12, 12. Yeah, that's even worse. Man, okay. So it'd be a big... A big. Uh, I would like to buy the one that is an upgrade, though. It. I think it's Bandersnatch was eighteen eighteen. Forward weapon. Oh no! Oh, what's the one right under the Bandersnatch then? Deck weapon. The Hell Thrasher. Eighteen eighteen. Eighteen eighteen. Oh man, we can't. We can barely afford that. Yeah, we would. But we'd be selling our other cannon back too. Yeah, we'd get another hundred or so back. I it doesn't seem like a big upgrade, but it. It might make the difference. Yeah. Just those yeah, three? Suppressor. The engine never explodes at full power. Oh. Huh. It goes to aft. No thanks. All right. Well, do you want to try it? Yeah, because I don't know when the next time we're going to have a new awesome gun is. Okay. All the all the awesome guns we've had have been forward weapons. No. Okay. Deck. Turn. All right. And now sell back our old gun. Yep. Let's see. And I... Th no, the no, other no, that's one. the one we just got. Naval surplus. Yep. The denunciation. All right. Sell. 250. And that's the one we just bought. All right. Yep. So we might as well. And now we've got a aft weapon. Why not? Let's look at our ship again. Shipyard. Or oh, hold. Okay. So we still have a blue Cintelec? No. 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 Okay. It's just been unlocked as an item. Yeah. <laughs> that a, threw me off for a second. So yeah. now, now we want to fill. I think we want to fill with fuel and food. With our 200 or so that we have left. Okay. Let's see. Fuel and food from her. Okay. Buying up to like 25 or 26? I mean... I think this is an expedition. We got 120. I don't know how much we're going to get lowered. You know? Okay, 30 is good. And then I'd say spend the rest of our 1,000 that we can afford on supplies. Uh, No, not the 1,000. No, 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 no. I'm saying up to 1,000. Oh, okay. So that 86... Uh, all right. I'm not really worried about supplies. They don't. They don't go down very fast. I'm, I'm forty twenty. I'd rather get two more fuel. Well, see, I'm more worried about how slow we may move. Okay. There. That's it. Yeah. That's all we can afford. And because I think we're going to use more fuel and eat, sl you know, eat faster per meter. Okay. So our next uh, thing is to go and give our momentum mori to the Fathom King. The Fathom King. And knock out one more part of the Fathom's Bones quests. What? Oh, we don't have people. We had to recruit people. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, crap. Yeah, we're below... Okay, go to the stores first. Go to the shops, and let's sell our solace fruit. Uh, uh Miss are you sure? Yeah, they sell for 50. We're out of money. Uh, I think... Um, yeah, they are out of... We are out of money. We could also turn in some of the stuff to the Alarming oh, Scholar. Let's do that. We've got a lot of stuff. Oh, not we've stories. Got I, we got oh, 40, 40 of these. Let's sell one, see what it gives us. 10 of them. Oh, no, screw so that. Go down a little. It's uh, ambiguous. Elis. We have 16. We have one. But we're not. I don't know what we're saving them for. Yeah, we already we gave five, one for the chess piece. One, one. Two. Hmm. Not a lot of options. We can get rid of the Elith. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, 70. Good. Perfect. And oh, get a couple more of these off. Okay, if you want, I was just gonna give him like a lem something else. We don't have that many of five. Uh, the lamentable, we should have a few up from that. The skulls, sixteen. Yeah, whatever. Uh, we can make a cabinet out of those. Well, we should. Anyway, we have enough to recruit some people now. Yeah, and we should make a cabinet anyway. Okay, so 
I guess I'll carouse. Spend an echo on that. Uh, Wasn't so bad. New, new recruits. recruits. Okay, okay. Uh, one crew. Now, higher crew. London, higher crew. Three. Sixteen. I'm going to just keep on hiring crew. Yeah. Okay. One more and time. And 30 echo. Exactly enough. Yeah. 30 echo. All right. 22 out of 27. That's good. Yeah, it's good for now. And yeah. also, uh, go back to our study if we can. Okay. Uh, lodgings, study, continue. What we can we've got twenty one secrets. Oh, to make another iron anatomical cabinet. Uh, is that the one that increases our iron? Yes, increase our iron, and that's the one we sold up north for a thousand. Okay, yeah, I believe. Then let's either yeah, let's make an anatomical cabinet. All right, there we go. Seven secrets, seven iron. And okay. Do we want to make that shrine to stone too? Uh, hearts by seven. Yeah, I suppose. I mean, I don't know what else to do with it. Yeah. We'll find a place to sell it. Yeah, there is a the it sells at uh, eighteen secrets. It sells south on the southern shoreline. I think either Adams Way or Varchus or someone sold it for twelve hundred. Okay, cool. All right, now now let's get out of here and go to the Fathom King. Yeah, now we got to deliver for the Fathom King. There we go. Now we're moving at a good clip. Yeah, a better clip. Yeah, it feels feels a little slower, and also the ship isn't isn't as big as I thought it was going to be. Uh, yeah. Did you think it was actually going to be physically bigger on the map? Yeah. Yeah. I did, too. I kind of felt like it was going to look like a transport liner, you know? Yeah, but this is just... I, I, I have to go back and, like, overlay two of the things, but I think it's about the same size as our last ship, which they may have done just because of the size of the map and stuff. Yeah, but I honestly thought it was going to be more along the lines of those... those uh, oh. Crabs. Well, we'll try out our new guns. Oh, look, like 360, like I was saying earlier. Did I not install... Oh, okay, aft weapon. Here we go. dun 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 <laughs> Um, I'll butcher it for supplies. Yeah. So. I think we're going to start. And I'll shoot this one with my rear gun, and there's the blood from the last crab. Your rear gun has not quite the arc I was thinking it would. Oh, he's chasing me. We're not as fast as I was hoping. And that thing has a real slow warm-up. Yeah, it is not great on the warm-up. Hmm. I was hoping to use this as a monster gun. I mean, it still wrecks crabs, but... Yeah. But they only have one danger rating. And now, it has a pretty high stagger. It has eight stagger. I don't know what that qualifies. Oh, it's not counting up. Let's. Oh, I have to retarget. we we got to go east from here. Oh, no, no. I thought we were further south than we were. Sorry, my buddy. Not quite. We do still need to go east, but... I like how we've made, like, the uh, the trefoil. Yeah, it, 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 mostly because of your light arc. Yeah. Without the light arc, it wouldn't be so trefoily. Okay, station three... If we want, I'm more concerned about turning in that gun to the Fathom King. I just want to knock that out, you know? Uh, yeah, it's pretty much on the way. I mean, yeah, it adds a little more time to stop in. This is weird. It's going to change change combat the way we've been doing it for a long time. Yeah, it changes combat, and I was expecting the aft gun to have a greater range and arc. I didn't think it was going to be that much, but I did think that they were going to touch a little better. Yeah, it, well, it's so slow, too. Yeah, it's super slow. That is almost not... I, I don't like that, actually. Yeah. I wish... And I do wish that there was, like, a, like we had gotten a legendary weapon or some other best, better weapon. Because the pickings for deck and aft seem pretty damn slim. Yeah, we may be coming up against the edge of, what, of the kind of guns you can have. Oh, he's not around. Oh. Failed. Didn't find anything. All right. Huh. Wait. Yeah, okay, we didn't get our port report. I didn't see an option for a port report. We must have... I think it's in the little gate, and you have to have something away to you. Hmm. Maybe? I don't know. don't know. It's been a while. We, we, we spent so long there, but we kind of avoided it for a while, too. Yeah. So I was too busy sexing. <laughs> And we just didn't go in there for a while because we had no Sooth and Cooper. Which I, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I've been expecting to find more Tomb Colonists and Sooth and Cooper long boxes than we have. Yeah. It, in the beginning. haven't popped up very often. Before this game was released, when we first started playing it, and I was playing it on my own, I f swear to God I found more of that sort of stuff. And then when it came out, like, it's like... Uh, I've been expecting to slice open one of those, uh, one of those sacks and find a new Jonah. Sack? <laughs> <laughs> Port report. Alright, moving out. 
Hmm, I'm trying to decide whether or not I'm happy about our purchase of the ship. I mean, the good news is you can always, you know, trade in. We'll lose a little bit of money on it. Yeah, I... I have to agree with you. I wonder if our commenters are going to be upset with us for selling off our gun. You know? You shouldn't have done that, you jagged apes! <laughs> Uh, I, although it was just about the equivalent of some of the more expensive guns. Well, and that being said, the it, if we go back to the Iron Republic, it says the the option for funding a tittering artificer's uh, project is still there, so potentially we could build another one. Well, uh, that was that was where we got like so the tittering artificer got us one thing, right? Uh huh. And then the irrepressible cannoneer plus the tittering artificer got us another thing. And we still have that cannoneer. Yeah, but that. We turned a thing we dug up on Ace of All into that thing. Yeah, the Judgment's Egg. We no, can buy those. it wasn't the Judgment Egg. It was the Mark of Red Science. We dug that up on Ace of All. Remember, it was a special oh. event. So I, I think the Memento Mori is a is a or Mori is a one-time thing. Hmm. Okay, audience, of the Fathom King. Yes, got a gun for you, big guy. Give me back my Outcast. Oh, what? its mind is gone. But if you have a new Fluke Core. Interesting. Uh, that is a new... I think we got a new quest. Seven Captivating Treasures. Well, maybe you don't. Uh, I don't think we do. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, let's... Witness and Execution. Boom of the King. Oh, yeah. So, Father's, Father's bones. bones. Okay. Father King and Memento Mori. Let's bear witness to the principal's end. How old oh. was the principal? Was the eldest? Perhaps old enough to satisfy the Fathom King. Okay. Let's do it. We witnessed it. Unending. Hurry. Oh, this is the, uh, this is the principal's. Uh, yeah, no, I... Th this is the principal's voice. Oh. Hurry. Uh, the principal was whispery. Yeah. The Fathom King's growly. Yeah. The principal was... <laughs> I thought the principal's was... I will, f I will be less, and they will be more, and it rises, and I falls. Hmm. Well, and I was... I was... It told me I was going from the captain's perspective of I'm telling the story to the Fathom King. Oh, oh, you're saying this is the Fathom King saying, "Hurry, my thoughts are for words." No, this is this is me as the captain telling the Fathom King the story of the ending of the principles. So I'm retelling what happened. Okay, so you're not going to do a voice for you're going to do. I was going to do the, the captain's voice. Okay, or, I'm okay with that too. Hurry, my thoughts grow burdensome, and then at the chess game's end, the dissolution. The Fathom King listens. A single tear rolls down his cheek, though his face remains expressionless. His chamberlain steps forward to remove the tear with a darting tongue. My bride's family, he tells you, they have long grown eccentric, and the principal's was the most eccentric of all. Yes, that is sufficient. Come closer, and I will tell you something of other dissolutions. Got a secret. Fulfilled his request for the account of the eldest end. Oh, man, that's... I honestly that's, didn't know what we were going to do for this. I, yeah, we were, we had some things, uh, we were talking about, like, killing the, el the tree again? Yeah, the tree of ages or something. All right, so, your complexity, here is a miracle of engineering, of sacrifice, and of the red science. I present the Memento Mori. Here we go. Intriguing. What a completely horrible object. The Fathom King observes. Honestly. If you had flayed a star and brought me its skin, I couldn't be more appalling than this. But I recognize the achievement. You have fulfilled my requests. At his gesture, a drowny child walks forward, bare feet slapping, to present you with a knife of coral. The Chamberlain, meanwhile, kindly arranges to replace your device with a weapon from a ship they had recently eaten. So, by the way, we just got the gun we bought. The Caminus Yard's Bandersnatch. It's a no, it's a torpedo one. Oh, okay. Okay, so we got a secret. Yeah, we got it. They gave us a gun. That's cool. I didn't expect that. Yeah. I guess that means if we'd have given them our engine, they'd give us an engine back. Son of a bitch. Interesting. And we that's, that's it. The Fathom King's key. Yes, 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 yes. Do it, do it, do it. Finally, the Fathom King beckons you closer. You have done everything I asked. So few people do. You know... You are an exception, and so I shall make an exception for you. You bend to place your ear by his mouth. Well, he here. takes a bite. Yeah. The reek of the drowned. The Fathom King stinks of salt and rotting flesh, but also of something electric, ozone, alien. His breath is cold. He whispers in your ear, and he presses something into the palm of your hand. Go now. 
Good luck. He smiles thinly. Perhaps one day your child will stand before me and ask the same question. Got a sweet enigma? Stone fragment. Oh, the location. Location of a stone fragment from Advent Horizon. So, okay, so we got to check our journal now. All right. I th- yeah, I guess... Oh, get, por- get a portal. Por- 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 yeah, no. okay. <laughs> journal. Okay, All so right. where do we go now? Uh, Your father's bones. I th- it sounds like we're going to go to the Advent Horizon. And then, since it's a portal, maybe we insert a key... Uh, hang on. I've, oh, here we go. The location of a stone fragment from the Abbot Horizon. Take it to your destination. Hmm. Okay. I, where's our destination? I guess the Abbot Horizon. Yeah. What? What's the footprint say? What's next? Huh. Huh. Okay. Well. I guess. I guess the Abbot Horizon. Uh. Well. Okay. So we. Way back in the day, we went. To, didn't we go to the Avid Horizon to look for our father's name and his sins? And we found part found of his name. Yeah, found it was broken off. Asked the Fathom King where it was. He gave us the location. What is it? Yeah, the location of a stone fragment from Avid Horizon. Hmm. Maybe it's on Avid Horizon? Yeah, maybe we go there first and then fall like Bloodhound. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, but... Maybe we can figure that out next time. Yeah, we will. Uh, we'll figure that out next time. Is that a forward weapon? Yeah, it's a forward weapon torpedo. Okay. Hmm. It costs one torpedo component per use. Does a f ton of damage. Eight yeah, second stagger. Yeah. Oh, you know, I wouldn't. I, I don't mind. Uh, I, I had been secretly planning to install a torpedo in the front next time we did it because we rarely go head to head with something unless we really need to damage it. Yeah. So. Well, we can just hang on to this with our our, our sweet gigantic hull. Are you, wait, are you saying we got enough room in the hull to now just sort of frivolously hold on to things? Yeah, we can just hold on to everything. Woo! Yeah, oh. we got an anatomical cabinet, shrine of stone. Yeah, uh, where do they? Oh, they equipped to the auxiliary. Dang! Yeah. I was really hoping well, one of them would attach the bridge by now, yeah. or that they would add us another space. I and mean, we've got a big ass ship. Why don't I have two bridge slots? Yeah, or two deck gun slots. That'd be sweet. Yeah, that makes sense. Anyways, we will catch you guys later on yeah, Players Disconnected we'll to the Sea. The Further Mysteries. And yeah, where are my daddy's bones? Bye. Ciao.